In this video, we're going to look at how to record money coming into your business that isn't from a customer that's been invoiced. For example, if you owned a shop, this could be recording your daily takings. To do this, you open Bank Accounts and then choose Bank Receipt. Remember, this isn't income from a customer that we've invoiced, so it is the Bank Receipt rather than the Customer Receipt option. It's then just a case of entering the details of the transaction such as the bank account that the money is going to be paid into, the date that it was received, a reference number, this could be an internal reference number you might use, it could be a check number, or you could just leave it blank. You can record an extra reference, and then you need to specify a nominal code. Your nominal code is the category for the income. In this case, we're going to choose our sales nominal code. You can specify a department, project reference and some details. You then enter the net value of the income, the appropriate tax code and the tax value should calculate automatically. If you need to split your income between maybe different bank accounts, allocate it to different nominal codes or even break it down between different tax rates then you need to enter these as separate items. It's just the one entry in this example, so we can click Save. If we then close the Bank Receipts window, back to our Bank Accounts list, that's how easy it is to record your income in Sage Accounts.